Hey friends, Kate Attack here. Welcome back to another episode of Firewatch. Now we're jumping back in. We're at a point where we just got back to our tower and someone had ransacked the place. Stole blankets, a bunch of food, all that bullshit. And we're trying to report it and we can't, so now we're going to try and figure out what we're going to do about it, so... Uh, I remember leaving off feeling very creeped out. <laughs> and I kind of don't want to leave the tower, but it is daytime, you know, so it's not like we're going to be wandering around in the dark. You know, Mr. Flashlight guy is not going to be able to see us, so. Um, but they broke our poor window. What a dick. Stole our sheets. Like an asshole. Uh, so we had to sleep on this, uh terrible rug looking thing um i don't know what to do with all our books here i don't just want to like throw them in a pile just clean up the whole place birds of wyoming death strikes at two the stuff seems to kind of stay in the same place, I guess, that we put them, so we'll clean up a little bit. Patriots. Glory. Cool book cover. Any other books? That's it. Um, and then our thermos, which I couldn't quite set down. Oh wait, put back. There we go. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so, beautiful day. One thing I never did look at was this. This is Henry. This is us. This sweet looking guy and I... Julia. I guess we don't get to see your face. I guess that's on purpose. But, I don't know. I'd kind of like to see your face at some point. I want to see what she looks like. What the fuck? Dude. Put back. There we go. Okay. Save for later. Hold E. Okay, so it's just gonna go into our backpack or pocket, I guess. I don't know where he put it. So, alright, let's... Oh! Cute. Okay, we're gonna turn the lights off because we're, we're, we're good people. Alright, let's boogie. <clears throat> let's go places. Whew. Lovely place. Our poor window. Tisk tisk. So, if I remember right, we gotta go, she said, through the cave and head north? That. Ah. Hmm. Oh, oh, sorry, Mr. Broseph McCatterton. Oh, it's like fog. Oh. Okay, so first off, what's over here? This isn't where we came from, right? We came from the other side of the outhouse. Right? Yeah, so we had to go... Wait. So we're here. I don't know why it shakes like that. That's definitely not me. So we can go... Sal, what's this medicine wheel? We've we been there? I guess this little these red lines, is that where we've been or is that a pathway? Or I don't know. I can never tell. Alright, I just do wanna I do wanna see what's down here first. I wanna explore. Just a little bit. Oh. I guess we get sidetracked everywhere. And look at all the different places we can go. I can't go down there. Hang on. Hang on. I want to explore. We're going to see what's over here. Whomp. Can I climb this? No. Ah, okay. Alright. We can definitely get through. Oh! A rock slide, okay. 
Two Forks Fire Lookout. That's us, right? Huh. Uh, whoa. Delilah, the trail I hiked in on, it's... Oh, it's, this is uh, where we came gone. from. What is this, the Twilight Zone? No, there was, a, there was a rock slide. Is there another path out of the thoroughfare? Ah, uh, um, let me think. Oh my god, wow. I guess I'm lucky I wasn't on it when it happened. Yeah, for sure. You know, without some impossible mountaineering, there's not really another way out. So what the hell? We'll fly you out? I mean, sometimes wow. folks get cut off by fire and we just scoop them up when it's time to go. <sighs> okay. Oh! Don't be nervous. This is where I came from? For real? Maybe I'll just live uh, out here. Maybe I'll just live out here now. Henry the Hermit. Maybe I'll, I'll find myself a baby bear to keep as a pet. And she got my name right. Land like Grizzly Adams. Alright. I guess this is where we came in on. Okay, that's fine. I think? I don't know. Maybe I just don't recognize it after this point. Maybe they didn't even show this part. I don't know. Alright, so that's where we came in. So we turn right, that's up towards the lookout. This way is real foggy right there. Cold mountain fog. Hang on. I want to look at it. How do I report it? Oh, there we go. Oh, it's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are Ooh. cold in Boulder though, right? Yeah, they are. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what's life like? Um... Uh, you know, boring if you don't ski. We used to go to this <laughs> bar called The Dollar, though. I love that place. Oh, wait, Ooh. is that down on Pearl? They have all the money pinned to the ceiling? Yeah, that's it, yeah. <laughs> I love that bar. Why don't you go anymore? Um... I took this job. Oh, <laughs> duh. Ooh. Hey, can you hold on a sec? Uh, sure. I'm just gonna keep... Hiking and hoping it warms up. Yeah. I wonder what she's hey, doing. I don't think so. Why, have you? Uh-oh. Okay, good. I don't know no, what to do. I don't do. think he has any idea. I don't... I'm absolutely sure. <gasps> A turtle. Would you? What's going on here? All right. I'll let you know if anything changes in that regard. Okay. Hey, sorry about that. Major anyway, sus. Is anyone or Major sus. Anything you want to talk about? Fire away. Who was that? Who was who? I I don't think he has any idea. What what was that? Were you talking about me? Uh, what? You left your button pressed or something. Henry, that call was work. I was just talking to Actually, it's not really your business. Why are you freaking out? I'm not freaking out. I'm Good. just I'm gonna go quiet for a little bit. Call me if it's important. Oh no. Okay, maybe I maybe I shouldn't have said anything. Maybe maybe I maybe I just should have kept quiet. Fuck, I don't know. But that that seemed major majorly suspicious. But um I guess in the meantime, we have a new buddy. Look at this little guy. <gasps> oh, look at him, he's so cute. Look at that happy little face. Hey buddy. We're gonna adopt you. <gasps> I got an achievement called Love Turts. Love Turts. Love that. Okay. Alright, so we pissed off Delilah. Um, she's gonna ignore us for a while. Let's uh, just cross this fairly easily. Let's get into this box. What does this box have? Let's put in our... Super secret, super secure passcode. And what do we got? Another map info. Great. And another note. Uh, Q. Ron. Really wish the powers that could be... Wait. Really wish the powers that we could... Why can't I read this? Ron. Really wish the powers that could... Why is this such a weird sentence for me? <laughs> Ron. 
Really wish the powers that be could issue us radios that didn't suck ass. Most of the time I'd prefer to keep things pen to paper, but every once in a while it'd be nice to get a hold of you right away. My sister keeps leaving me messages at the main office, but I don't think that she gets that I took the job so I wouldn't have to deal with her or mom. I've been sitting at the spot for a while now, thinking about what to say to her, but I'm a quarter away through a bottle of Fife's instead. Miss you. Dave. Aw. Um, I guess we'll keep this with the rest of the notes? Old toilet paper? <laughs> okay. Alright, um... Throw that back in. Little pine cone. Cute. Throw that back in as well. More toilet paper. Some books. Alright. Look at this. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's just the sun, I guess, peeking in on the top of the log. Alright, we're gonna explore... I think this is a dead end? Yeah. Yes? Yeah, dead end. Okay, now we'll actually go do what we set out to do in the first place. And maybe Delilah will talk to us at some point again. I mean, I didn't, I didn't mean to upset her, but that's a uh, kind of a weird call, you know. It's that's that's real suspicious, and I I don't feel comfortable. I don't feel comfortable. So I haven't really quite crafted any theories about Delilah just yet. But something's off. Something's definitely off. Okay, um. I feel like we're just taking random trailheads at this point. Oh, wait, here we go. Here we go. Jonesy Lake, Two Forks, Ruby River. Okay, so. We gotta go back up to that cave to go find some communication power lines, something. I don't I don't know. Was this the which lake was this? Oh, okay, so we went to Jonesy Lake. Is that the same lake that we were at to go get rid of the, the people who did fireworks? We just took a different pathway? Oh, hey, that's us. Okay, so we're close to the medicine wheel. What's at the medicine wheel? Got like a cute landmark of sorts. Oh. It's just a bunch of rocks and like a, a wheel shape. Okay. Interesting. Alright, um, I'm sure we'll come back here. So let's head back up to the tower and then go actually good, you know, do what we set out to. I think we're done getting distracted for five minutes. I think it was this way. Yeah, there's the sign. Go up this way. Glad he can run for some time walk is so slow. Um, this pathway will do, right? Wait, no. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. That just took us kind of in a weird... Okay, that's fine. That's fine. As long as it gets us to our destination, right? Alright. So I believe the cave... Just behind, just behind that house. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Yeah, here's the pathway. Oh. Ooh, that wind last night actually tore up some trees near my tower. I know, right? Ugh, it's out of this world. Now, imagine we had a big fire burning. Oof. Yeah. Jesus. It's something else. I've seen a still evening kick up 45 mile an hour winds in no time. If that happens this summer, you'll really be in for it. 
Bear tooth points. Mm. Okay, I'm pretty sure it was this way. This seems right. How does he jump down that? Like, I don't know. I'd be worried about my ankles, man. Maybe, maybe I'm just clumsy, but I feel like I would, I would probably land wrong and like break my ankle. Okay, did she say to go through the cave and go north? North of the canyon. Okay. So... Alright. Run faster. A bird? No, it's a butterfly. North of the canyon. So that would be... Yes, I need to head towards that same spot I was in before with the creepy, creepy cabin where I got attacked by a raccoon. I think. Seems right. I want to find the key to that place. I want to go in there. Creepy cave sounds. It's fine. It's normal. Okay, we're just gonna go. Damn, it's foggy. I guess yesterday we kind of started midday, so it had a chance to warm up, but damn, this creeps me out. Going the right way, right? Yeah, seems like the right way. Going up towards the creepy cabin, picking on the lines. See if they're okay. This one looks okay. Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. Okay, it looks fine. That one looks fine. Maybe something further along is forked. All right. That one looks fine. I don't remember going this way. Was I even able to go this way? Oh. But it looks okay. Getting kind of a creepy vibe all of a sudden. Don't know. Don't know why. <laughs> but mm, definitely getting a a vibe of sorts. Guess we're just gonna follow it all the way up. Everything looks to be intact so far. Aw, more beer cans? Guess what? What is it? There's a bunch of empty cans up here. Same as before? Yep. These fucking kids. Us. Ugh, these dummies. How could these girls be so stupid? Trust me, I never underestimate Long the stupidity of a drunk teenager. Also, I never underestimate the balls of a drunk young woman, having been one. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna jump through the long jump down. Hopefully it's not horrible. Okay, we're fine. Any more cans? This looks like a weird grave. But I guess it's just the rock formation. 
All right, this one looks fine. So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires? What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just I mean... seems dangerous. Well, if they don't hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out. But I'd rather it not come to that. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Okay, good. Any sign of those girls? Did they mm. mess with anything? I'll look around. Expect the line up close. Yep, more stupid cans. These little shits. These little shits. Okay, so I guess they went this way. Oh, pricks. Alright, let's uh, take a look here. So we gotta climb up this side. Let's take all these cans. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? Oh. God forbid there's an the actual tricks? fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Ooh, <laughs> let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. I want to go got? take a look at this. Does I that say I go to hell? To just find them and scare the hell out of them. Okay. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm, I don't know. Um... <sighs> Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. Ooh. I'll find them. We're gonna get Thanks. spicy up but in I'm here. But I'm gonna need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. I mean, I'd yes. start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Yeah, I've already got a trail. Well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. Smoke? I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. Alright. Um, so that says go to hell, I'm pretty sure. 90, 90% sure. That's what it says. Can I even get up here? No. Okay. Alright, we're just gonna follow their stupid beer can trail. That they were dumb enough to leave. Dumb dummies. Okay, so we can go both ways, but I want to make sure I get all these stupid beer cans. We're just gonna follow the trail. It's like Council and Gretel, but they're dicks. See any more that way? Oh. Um. I've got an overgrown trail here. Yeah, that'll happen. So I'm screwed when it comes to getting past it. Mhm. Mm screwed until you clear it yourself. Yeah. Great. Well, if I come across some tools, I'll add groundskeeping to my ever-increasing list of responsibilities. <laughs> All right, so I guess we, we literally just can't get through there. Okay, that's good to know. I kind of like dead ends to a point because then I don't get like overwhelmed for choice when it decide you know, when I'm deciding like where to explore. So, you know, makes me kind of slow down and do things one step at a time and the game kind of chooses that step for me. I don't, you know, miss out on anything before that. All right, long drop down, let's do it. <sighs> All right. Two forks fire lookout or thoroughfare fire lookout supply drop. Go check out the supply drop. I don't know what's up here, but maybe something good. So they most likely didn't go this way. 
The so thoroughfare, four miles that way. 60 feet this way, supply drop. I wonder if there's any goodies. Oh! Well, hello. I'm assuming it's the same code. They're empty. Great. Maybe I come back here later. Oh, that looks dangerous. Okay. I guess, uh, we don't. Can I even get to thoroughfare from here? I would presume not. I don't think you're really meant to see her. Oh, oh. Oh lord, what is this? Hey, I'm out at a ravine. What's this thing that spans across it? That is how you get to my sector. No kidding. Well, let me hike over. Well, it's locked up and mainly for emergencies. I've never actually used it. Hmm. Rangers use it from time to time, but that's it. Help! Oh god, it's an emergency! <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, I got, I got, um, I got eyes on a tornado. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> a tornado in the heart of the Rockies? Yes. Holy moly, I need to call this in. Tom, Two Forks sees a tornado. I hate he this. He says he needs an evac into my sector. It's a meteorological impossibility. There haven't been tornadoes in the greater Yellowstone region in a hundred million years. You're gonna need him to stay and take a detailed personal account, <laughs> even if it means giving his life. <laughs> okay, I'll tell him. Sorry, Hank. No dice. I... Man. I have a love-hate relationship with this woman. Yeah, I... I mean, it looks perfectly functional to me. You know, I don't know how to get it back across, but... It looks functional. Totally, I would totally go over if I could. Alright, we're... For real this time, we're gonna we're gonna continue our quest. Again again. But I love those cute little lines between the two. As funny as she is, you know. She's so suspicious. Damn, she funny. Is this the way I came? No. I I must have taken a different way back. Huh. Um. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Suspicious? Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. There we are. Brian Goodwin. Oh, I guess I could have read it if I hovered over it. Oh, Okay, great. Ooh. Well, I am flush with ropes now. Nice. That pack was full of them. In decent condition, too. Nice, nice, nice. There's, there's enough rope here oh. that I could just Looks leave broken. them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. Oh. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian hmm. Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. What? Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Who was he? Was he a ranger or something? Oh, no, no. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, three summers ago. Oh. Great kid. You what? can bring children out here? What happened? Mm, no. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. Why? Where did they go? What, ha what happened? I, don't know. I never really hit it off with old Ned, and um, one day they were just gone. Sucks. Seems suspicious. Anyway, so it goes. Have uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a photodome employee. I don't know. I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Oh no. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. 
There we are. Now I can get up and down if I if I so choose. I don't know if I want to go down. But I definitely want to find my way back. I, I think I, I accidentally took a wrong turn somewhere. And that place is Oh, here. Well, I hopped down a drop and now oh, I, I can't have climb to. back up. Mm, that is a pickle. <sighs> Oops. I can just keep hiking, but I figured I should let you know in case I get myself trapped out here. Alright, I guess I have to. Well, hopefully that doesn't happen before you find these assholes. I was thinking you should probably head back to where you saw him last. Yeah, that's smart. That's that's <laughs> probably smart. Okay, so these look like good quality ropes, so I shouldn't break my back this time. All these ropes I have, dang! I could hook them up wherever I want. Magic. All right, all the way down. There we are. All right, what's over here? Another trail? Hey. A dead end? Sorry about snapping at you earlier. Um, I thought about it and. Yeah, I suppose that must have sounded kind of weird when you heard me take that other call. Plus, yeah. you're just out here in your own head. <laughs> Trust me, I know how it is. Yeah, it kind of so, sounded weird. Did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but... <laughs> I know um... I'm a bit of an outlier. Wait, I don't mean that the way it sounds. I mean, I care about people, and I like companionship as much as the next person. I'm actually married. But you're here. Everything's, Everything's fine. Fine. Just, you know, we're taking some yes. time apart, getting some. I don't, I don't know what else to say. Change. Yeah. All right. I... Well, we can just leave it at that. Thanks. Yeah, I honestly don't know what to say to that. So. Two, three, four. Date our map. Lovely. Oh, whoops! I didn't mean to close that. I wanted, I wanted those flowers. Oh well. All right, let's read this note. <clears throat> Dave, guess who's going out with Debbie next week? No, not that shit heel Steve. It's your man, Ron. I went up to check out the new guy at Two Forks and heard him talking to himself. More than usual for LOs, so I figured I'd stay away. Remember when you saw Chimney Rock having himself in that hammock? I'm starting to think the Forest Service only pr picks the deranged and perverted. Except for us, of course. We're the creme de la creme. Let's toast to Deb at the spot. Ron. Very cute. I don't know why I'm keeping all these notes, but, you know, why not? What the hell is this? Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. This could cool. be the same person who left that antler. And maybe they're leaving me an entire creature, piece by piece. Hate it. I hate it. Um, I guess we'll leave the stone. I don't, I don't know what else to, to do with it, so... All right. Um, okay, we didn't get much done, but uh, we're gonna continue on next time. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go check out that. Probably it's nothing. Probably nothing. Probably nothing. Um, so we're gonna call from here, and we'll continue on next time. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. Love your face, and take care of yourself. Peace.